more tonight about the circumstances surrounding a disturbing case of child abuse in Shelby County. Police say a 14 year old boy is fighting for his life after being kept in isolation in the home of his adoptive parents. This is in their basement. Tonight, we do have team coverage of the investigation as well as reaction from neighbors. We begin with CBS 42 News reporter Jamie Ostroff, who is live at the Helena Police Department. And Jamie, this is really a tough case for everyone involved. It is Sherry. In fact, Helena's police chief is calling this the most disturbing case a lot of his officers have ever seen. Even the chief himself is struggling to wrap his mind around it, he told us. Investigators say it all happened inside this house on Spruce Drive here in Helena. That is where that 14 year old boy was kept in isolation for a long time. Now, the chief wouldn't specify exactly how long it was, but by the time DHR and police did get involved in this case, they say that boy was severely malnourished. They say he was only about 55 pounds. That boy was in acute respiratory distress, suffering from hypothermia, hypothyroidism, and very close to death. Um, I don't know that angry is exactly the word. Um, upset, frustrated, and mostly I just um, feel sorry for this young man. The child's adoptive parents, Richard and Cynthia Kelly, are both being held in the Shelby County Jail tonight, charged with aggravated child abuse. Their bond set at a million dollars each while their adoptive son clings to the hospital. Now, we also learned this afternoon from Helena's police chief that there were two other adults living in that house with the Kellys and their adoptive son. We're going to get more into that at 6 o'clock. But for now, live in Helena, Jamie Ostroff, CBS 42 News.